Gantry Cranes No matter how the form of gantry crane, its composition is mainly divided into three parts, mechanical parts, structural parts, and electrical parts. Specifically, gantry crane mainly composed the gantry frame structure, trolley, running mechanism, electrical device, cabin, and other parts. Gantry Frame Structure The gantry frame structure is mainly composed of the main beam and the supporting legs. The main beam is used for supporting the loading trolley, and the supporting leg is running along the track through the supporting leg. The light gantry crane uses the single beam, the heavy gantry crane uses the double beam. As for the supporting legs of heavy crane, one side of the supporting legs generally use rigid legs, the other side uses a flexible leg in order to reduce the dead weight and compensate the deviation of span. Trolley Trolley of the double girder gantry crane is basically the same as that of bridge crane. Single main beam adopts electric hoist as a trolley but is not a common electric hoist. Running bridge structure. The trolley running mechanism is the same as the bridge crane, used respectively driven. As gantry crane generally operates in open air, the lower part of the supporting leg is provided with a rail clamping device or a rail gauge. When the crane does not work or in a strong wind, with the clamping to clamp rail in order to prevent the crane accident by the wind. Electrical structure. Motor. The running state of the motor is divided into two kinds, which are electric state and power generation state. In gantry crane, when the electric motor is introduced, the motor starts to run, and the electric energy can be changed into mechanical energy. This operation state is referred to as the electric state. When mechanical energy is added to the motor shaft, in addition to the loss of the motor itself, the motor can be converted into electrical energy. This state of operation is called the state of power generation. Under certain conditions, any motor can be operated by any state in the above two states. Cabin. Cabin is the site where operators control the gantry crane, as the gantry crane is an important hoisting equipment for loading and unloading large goods. The operation of the crane has a direct impact on the production efficiency. Therefore, the operator has a very strict requirements, for example, familiar with the use of longman crane, equipment, methods of operation, lifting capacity, and maintenance of knowledge, etc.